Okay. I mentioned in my intro that I started this, uh, this YouTube channel during a Grand Cardinal Cross, or Grand Cardinal Square. And what that means is that all four cardinal signs are, uh, have a, a planet visiting, or planet or two visiting them. So, um, uh, sun and moon, because it's a, um, it's a solar eclipse, um, sun and moon are both in Cancer, and that's like home, hearth, mom, apple pie, 4th of July, uh, but it ain't going to be all that sweet, because uh, it is being uh, mugged by three slower moving planets. Um, across the chart from it is Pluto and Capricorn, and um, Pluto like transforms whether you like it or not. It's like it doesn't itch off a band for a week, it just rips it off and you're transformed and you have to get rid of stuff. You have to like um, tear things down, throw away the dead wood. Uh, so I, I wouldn't say, you know, bring up like weird family issues at the barbecue because people have fire and they have knives and they have forks and they can hurt each other. You know, it's like put it off for another day. Just stand on your tongue with both feet. Okay, then we have Saturn in Libra. Now, Saturn in Libra, Saturn is like the authority figure or dad uh, and, and he wants things to be fair and be polite. So if you're at a family gathering, be nice to the old guys and just be polite and be nice to the moms and just like, or don't go. We just don't go because Uranus is in Aries. That's another card. Uranus says, I'm independent. I'm going to be revolutionary. And Aries says, I'm going to fight. I'm going to fight for any kind of reason. Well, if you're feeling that kind of energy, don't go. Don't go to the family reunions. Don't go to the picnics. Don't do it. Just say, you're sick. Well, you know, and then just leave ellipsis. You know, I'm sick, dot, dot, dot. Don't say what you're sick of or what you're sick with because you could just like, be sick of the family. You're sick of that stupid potato salad. Ugh, why do you put mustard in the potato salad? Just say, I'm sick, I can't come. And don't, it, just let them fill in the blanks, okay? Because they'll be happier without your cranky energy, all right? Now, what I'm saying is that during a grand cardinal, so like a grand cardinal square, there's a cardinal, 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 and they're squared, you know, like four, four corners in a square, and they're opposed to one another. Now, everybody goes, oh, squares and oppositions, oh, I'm afraid. No, don't do that. Oppositions are opportunities to find a balance in between. And Eileen Locke uh, on Blog Talk Radio says, squares are like stairs. You can go up, to, up the stairs with a little bit of effort and see things from a higher ground. Have a higher perspective. Okay, now if you wanted to do that, if you wanted to utilize this energy of a grand cardinal square, you could. But if you don't feel up to it because you haven't figured out how to do it, then stay home. Don't go and bother people with your cranky energy. Okay, there it is. <laughs>